the last 19 months, Andrew, I have prided myself on watching fluffy, light-hearted movies, which was another thing that really helped a lot of people because we were going through so much. You're going to laugh. I actually really liked Kong Skull Island <laughs> with Samuel L. Jackson. Let me tell you, anything with Samuel L. Jackson, I will watch. But it was just lighthearted and fun, and I enjoyed watching it. I went through all the Fast and Furious movies again. That was always a fun to watch. Mm-hmm. Um, but recently, Andrew, recently, my husband and I have started doing something we used to do a long time ago when we were in our 20s. Uh, we've gone back to watching movies in the cinema. Yes. And it's been really, really nice. So like I mentioned earlier, I um, I watched The Eternals. Mm-hmm. Um, and, and that was just really great. And I'm not going to give away any spoilers, but I will say this. I really like that in the Eternals, the diversity is natural. You know, that's the kind of world I live in, a very diverse world, different cultures, different, you know, genders and all of this. And 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 the Eternals is really cool for many reasons, one of which is, you know, the black guy isn't the black guy in the movie. He's just a guy. Yes. The, the gay person isn't a gay person in the movie. They're just a, a, a person. The, the the woman is not a woman in the movie. She's just a person. And the characters are just doing their thing. And, and that was really refreshing to see. And then I watched, of course, Dune. Dune I watched with my husband. And he has loved that book <laughs> from the moment I met him in my early 20s. So yes. it was really nice. It was a full circle moment. Like, ah, let's go watch Dune. And he knew all the characters and this and that. That was really nicely done. And the standout, though, for me, and this happened only a couple of weeks ago, was The Last Duel, Mm -hmm. um, which is Ben Affleck and Matt Damon partnering up again. And I loved Good Will Hunting. I loved that movie. Those those two are pretty awesome when they get together like this. And The Last Duel is really powerful because it's a story told from different perspectives. And as as a coach, somebody who works as a coach, that really resonates strongly with me because the client will come and they'll share their perspective and they'll believe that that is the truth. And it's your job as a coach to say, Hey, you know, there are different perspectives. Let's, let's, uh, let's, let's interrogate that. Yeah. Um, Because if a particular perspective is kind of messing you up mentally or emotionally, you might want to invite different perspectives in. Um, So the last duel is a great movie. And um, Ben Affleck is is really good (laughs) in the movie. His character is great. And Adam Driver, of course, is also um, um, amazing. Um, I love stories. I love storytelling. And I really enjoy going back to movies because it's something I hadn't done in a long time. So Mm. again, you know, some things are resurrecting themselves again. Uh, Other things are new. Um, But yeah. That's um, that's been some movies, books, and all that I've really um, enjoyed. And in terms of TV series, um, 